What's up guys, the May Patreon rewards are now available. Cyclonic Rift, Jace the Mind Sculptor, and Avison Angel of Hope are all available through the end of the month. If you'd like to support our channel and pick up these sweet proxies, you can do so at patreon.com slash it resolves or by clicking the link in the description below. What's going on guys? Welcome to part two with mono white cats. Uh, yes, this deck is silly. No, I do not care. And holy crap, is it fun? Um, I'm absolutely loving it. Uh, didn't do amazing in the first video, but I would recommend you check that out. You can kind of see the deck as a whole. Uh, we do have the list down below if you want to play it or, or uh, do anything like that, but I uh, would recommend you do that first. So this hand is not an amazing hand, but I'm going to keep it. We'll give this a shot. I don't have high hopes, but we'll see. Uh, that actually helps pretty w uh, tremendously, in fact. I'm going to play this first since we know we're not playing a one uh, one drop here. Um, probably going to be Orzov. Yeah, enchantments. Uh, this was actually the deck we faced, uh, the last deck we faced. So let's play the Pouncing Lynx first. The expectation is that they'll deadweight this or Myers Grasp or something along those lines, which is fine. Um, let's burn it on this and not the Pride Mate is kind of the, the thought process. Oh, okay. They might still very well deadweight this. Okay. I like this version of this list. Um, we played a list almost almost exactly like this very recently, and it was fun, but it was not what we needed it to be, uh, if I'm honest. All right. Let's do this. Let's attack him. They're not going to block. That was the expectation. Um, let's do this. And I'm actually going to play this out now. This is something that will almost definitely eat a removal spell. Despite really not needing a removal spell, they've got plenty of... Uh... Ooh, very cool. Very cool indeed. Not gonna block, obviously. Hmm. 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 We're going to try and get rid of Gideon. We kind of have to, I think. Um, and just keep him away from... Got rid of one of the walls, get a counter here, and get a little bit of damage at least on Gideon. Um, chances are we're going to be losing some major stuff this turn. I'm weirdly taking this game seriously, and I shouldn't, but that's okay. Um, that's very, very good. This interaction is really sweet. Um, is she going to give it indestructible, I assume? Vigilance. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Thankfully, we have this. We also just have this, which is a possibility. Um, Cause everything plus one plus one. Uh, I'm kind of in for doing this. Let's try and get rid of this. Maybe shouldn't have attacked with uh, Kahira. Might have been a mistake. They're just not going to block. I guess that makes sense. Uh, they were going to lose it anyway. But I kind of think they... Well, we had Indestructible. Never mind. I'm very sorry. That was silly. That's fine, actually. It still stays on the board. So, like, that's fine. This is a cool deck. I like this version. 
Um, we played Norzov Enchantment deck, but it was much more removal focused. It was not quite so, uh, we'll say aggro. We'd really like to not draw lands. That would be ideal. Um, let's go over. Yes, these tap. Uh, that's fine. We're just trying to get rid of these guys, essentially, or this. All right. What? Mardu? What is this? I did not expect this. I am so intrigued. Yeah, yeah. I assume Vigilance. No, oh, just Indestructible. Okay. <laughs> I'd like to draw not a land. That would be lovely. Pretty big hit there. Okay, well, technically that's not a land. <laughs> Get rid of this. Gain some life, get a counter there, and play a cat. Woo! One more, and we can get rid of this Heliod's Punishment as well. Um, I'm going to let that through. Don't love doing that, but I think that's okay. Wow. Yeah. Woo-hoo! Killing it. <laughs> Oh, this doesn't have lifelink right now. Yes. Doing the most. They run Shatter? What? I mean, what do we want? We want Icon of Ancestry, right? Like, that's the card we need. Ah. Well, that's pretty good. Hey. No. <laughs> really not feeling the land here, guys. This isn't helping. Um, they can give this trample. I was feeling so good. Maybe we were... No, I don't think we were too proactive with the uh, Unbreakable Formation because we kind of needed it at that time. So I think we were right to do that. We're just going to make them pay the red. No reason to, obviously, but we're going to hope they forget. Oh my goodness. How many land can we possibly get? Seriously? I'm very ready to concede. We're going to attack. <laughs> All right, opponent. What are you doing? I don't know what they're... I mean, they're looking through the graveyard. I don't really know why. Really? Are they just being a tool? That was kind of a tool thing to do. Yeah, it comes under our control. I think they didn't mean to do that. I think they meant to pull back one of these guys, but that's fine. That does mean our attack was really, really bad, just because, obviously. Alright, I'm just... There's no way. Um, all right, we're going to move on to game two. Um, I will say that game was pretty back and forth in that, like, you know, they play a Gideon, we had to kill it. It was, it was pretty cool.
Um, so well done, opponent. Um, I definitely think they did not mean to to pull that from my graveyard. I think they thought they were gonna get it. All right. Um, sure. Let's try it. We'll charm stray first, and then primate. Just so we've got a life linker out. What was this? Oh, okay. Sure. How much you want to bet this doesn't make it? Quench it. Oh, no. Bounce something. No. They're just a cycler's deck? Is that what this is? <clears throat> yeah, that's cool. I'm glad we've been drawing a couple lands. We drew way too many last game, though. Huh. Not what I expected at all. Um, I kind of just want to get the primate down. Let's just do this. That way we get counters up. I don't know if that's right or not. We could have just played this, given everything vigilance. Wow, voice cracking, guys. Given everything vigilance, but I don't, I don't see that being a big deal. Interesting. Is this like a combo deck? Is that what we're doing? Um, you? I, I don't know. Might as well. Okay, so 5, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So, on the off chance that this does not kill, or not the off chance, for the simple fact that this does not kill, we need to get rid of this. If, in case this is a combo piece. Okay. That's not great. That just kind of reaffirms that I'm feeling like this is a combo piece, um, <clears throat> but we'll see. Let's get moving. Ah, okay. Mm hmm. Then we sh we definitely made a mistake. We could have attacked them, or we should have attacked them. Hmm. Next turn, we can Unbreakable Formation uh, and really go for it. I think that's the right goal. If they have a counter, that's going to suck. All right, cool. We got there. Thank you, Unbreakable Formation. All right, cool. Well, we got another win. That feels good. Uh, let's go ahead to game three. Hopefully, we can get one more win. Um, honestly, that's two wins now in total, uh, and that's kind of two more than I thought we would get. Uh, this is silly deck. It's a fun one. So, like, I didn't really expect a ton. <laughs> um, but, hey, Cat Tribal, man. It's the way to go. It's fun. It, it is genuinely really, really fun. Um... This isn't a great hand, but I will keep it. It's like another enchantment deck. These are like really going around right now. Um, the expectation is they just either kill this or... Oh, no Sentinel's Eyes. Um, I'm going to pass them. Ah. Nice bait. That was solid. Let's play you out, and let's play you out. Gaining that one back. Wow, they're really going all in. Wow. Um. I'm not going to block. <clears throat> it's pretty good. Um, let's do this. 
Let's do this. Hmm. Wow. Did they just win? Almost. That's pretty good, not gonna lie. Um get a counter up on this. Should have probably played the one from hand, but that's okay. These all have vigilance now at the very least, so. And this does not have trample, worth noting. So we do get the opportunity to block one, which we will. We'll just jump. Oh, that's mean. Oh, that's so mean. Did they give it pro green? Why did you not give it pro white? That was really kind of not good. They could have just won. Right? Am I missing something? They could have won, right? That seems really not right. Um, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, we can almost get them. Um, we're gonna mutate onto this. This is gaining us the most life, by the way. That's why we're doing this. Um, all right. I just want to like block all. Um, is it worth it to you? I think we have to. Um, we could unbreakable formation next turn, but we're going to have to jump block this here, really. Oh, I mean, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Oh, we still win. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> I mean, they still have a butt ton of uh, availability, we will say. Um, I'm going to attack both here. We were fine if they wanted to trade off. <clears throat> it wouldn't have mattered. Uh, yeah. Please attack him. No. Okay. Ugh. Not what we wanted. Oh, gotta assume we can't do this, I assume, right? Luris really makes this annoying. Um, we need removal in this deck, like, super bad. So they can flash out one of these things, and it's got all the glitters on it, right? So... I'm not doing the math. <laughs> I'll be honest. Stops them for a turn, but now they have 39 life, so like, and we apparently can only draw lands, which is just fantastic. We are getting flooded with this deck, I will say that. Um, yeah. So the problem is now they can just replay everything because they have Luris. <laughs> um, granted, they can only do one of those cards per turn, but like here, Sentinel's Eyes, very, very good. Hmm.
Don't think we can really compete with this, but we're gonna try. Ginger brute, huh? That's cute. Yep. They can start n knocking this down. I don't want to hurt you. It's a cool deck. Um Hmm. That might have been incorrect. Probably should have done it on one of these guys. I'm really thinking hard on this and I shouldn't. I'm overthinking. Um, yep. Could we have... I guess we could have played this out then, right? Did I miss that opportunity? I think I did. Yeah, you got an unblockable 7-8. That's pretty good. Yeah, I think I did miss that opportunity. We could have done a little bit more damage there. Excuse me, an 8-9. You really didn't have to pay that mana. My hope for peace is gone. How many lands can we possibly draw? I just kind of want to see if this works. Since we put this over. Yeah, it does. That's cool. All right. So they can block one of these guys with this, uh, which sucks. We're just, eh, screw it. Oh, yes, block that way, block that way, block that way, block that way. That just means this is going to go away. This has first strike. I'll screw it. Man. <laughs> it's funny. Yep. Ugh, guys, this is rough. <sighs> Has vigilance because of the sentinel's eyes, right? Oh, sentinel's mark, okay. I have no idea what we could even draw here. Probably nothing. Yep. Heh <laughs> I guess that's not a bad one. I mean, <laughs> oh, I wish we could mutate that out. Um, it doesn't matter. Oh man, we have to try. This just means they have to block everything uh, except this if they don't want to, but does that mean Luris is going to die? No, they're going to give it protection. Okay. Man, if we could have dealt with this Luris, be in such great shape. <sighs> the struggle is real, guys. Do we just lose? We just lose, right? Yeah. All right, well done, opponent. Ah, uh, all right. Well, we won two in total, um, which is still more than I expected. That game was a little tough. I'll be honest. That was a, a bit of a struggle, but summation on the deck. It's fun, uh, and that's all I think you can ask for. In a cat tribal deck, like everybody loves cat tribal. Everybody tries to make cat tribal when you've got a lot of cats in standard, and it's fine. I get why. It's silly. It's great. 
but the reality is it's generally generally not the like tier one deck that everybody uh, maybe not expects it to be but kind of wants it to be um and that's fine like it's not meant to be i think i think there's a reason to just play fun decks and i think this is a fun deck uh we saw it take over in a couple games which was awesome like we were able to get some really really crazy good value uh do some really really good stuff and like go over the top and that was fun um even in the games where we didn't win, like that last game, that was a fun game. We kept kind of having to push through some damage, and we actually got a lot closer than expected, considering how far behind we were. Um, and so, like, I I like this deck. I think it needs some removal. Um, <clears throat> we really didn't have any, uh, and that's a problem. But regardless, I do think that this was a very, very fun list. I would absolutely say, if you're just looking to have some fun, try it out. Uh, especially if you've got most of the cards. I mean, a lot of the cards are not like crazy good so you should be able to get them pretty easily and pretty cheaply with your wild cards try it out uh cards like cub warden fantastic absolutely fantastic a johnny fantastic already we've had him for a while and he's great there's a lot of cards in this list that are just good um there are a lot of cards that are not good as well uh but that's okay it's it's for fun so i enjoyed this one i hope you guys did uh if you've got a deck suggestion whether it be a silly deck, kind of like this one, or a more serious kind of tier one deck, let me know. Let me try it out. I would love to do that. Uh, I know a lot of people have sent in a few suggestions. We've tried out Adam's. Uh, we've played a couple other decks that Adam kind of suggested for us, but we played like different versions of them. Uh, and so, you know, we played them without kind of consulting his list. So I do apologize, Adam. But uh, we do appreciate that. It, it's awesome to be able to throw those in there and say, you know, these were these were suggested by you guys. So hopefully it's something you really do want to watch. So regardless, I enjoyed this. I hope you guys did. <clears throat> Make sure to leave a like or a comment down below. Make sure to check out our website, itresolvesmtg.com, uh, if you're interested in purchasing those uh, islands. And again, the rest of those lands will be available very, very soon. They are on their way. So I'm excited for that. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Really do appreciate it. And I will see you in the next gameplay video.